Alrighty, so, hello everyone. Uh, this is a review of the Lamy Vista. Um, so a bit of story behind this pen. I've had this pen um, for about eight years now. Um, it doesn't have the original nib on it. Um, the original nib it came with, I think, was a fine. Um, it was like a chrome tip, but now I replaced it on Amazon for... Or I bought a replacement on Amazon with this kind of charcoal nib and it writes quite well um, so I got this pen as a gift this is my actually my first fountain pen uh, as you can see the the Lamy logo at the back is kind of worn down or Lamy? Lamy? I think that's how you pronounce it um, it's kind of worn down but it's still still a great pen and the there's signs of uh, use up here with this with the pen cap too and on my hands too uh, but yeah this has been a great pen um, it's a fine but as you can tell it it writes uh, I'm not sure if it's just because um, the tines have become a little bit more spread on the nib or if it's just how generally like European fountain pens tend to write broader than their Asian counterparts. So, yeah, even though this is a fine, it um, tends to write a little bit um, wider than other nibs. Um, yeah, what do I like about this pen? It's really smooth. Um, all of my, so right here, um, this is the ink that I've been writing with in this pen. Or, um, it's a really nice kind of subdued purple um, and you can see here it, I actually just inked it up so maybe that's why it's a bit darker um, but um, it writes really smoothly um, uh, on the on whatever kind of paper you use and a good thing about this this pen is at least it uh, if you're using like cheap printer copy paper um, it doesn't bleed through too much, um, so yeah, it doesn't. It tends to write wide, but doesn't put down a lot of ink. Um, and of course, that depends uh, what ink you put in. Um, but yeah, definitely, I've had like I have a Pilot Metropolitan that will put more ink down, even though it's a smaller size. If that makes sense. Um, yeah, so basically, um, this is a nice design, so basically you could like stand it down, um, stand it, balance it on the end like that if you wanted to. Um, the, yeah, it's a, uh, just snaps right in. Yeah, to get to the converter, you just unscrew it like that, and uh, this is the converter, it's a, uh, this did not come with a pen, but it's. Uh, I'd recommend that you get it or get a syringe to refill your cartridges to save the environment. Um, but yeah, you just basically how it works. You put it in the bottle, uh, push the piston down, and then uh, to get pull the ink out, you just turn it the other way, and the piston comes back up. Um, I, in terms of caring for this pen as you can tell I haven't done a real good job trying to keep the cap from getting all dirty also my finger um, but uh, you could rinse this out every couple refills um, I haven't had any problems with most of the inks so the first ink that I got um, was not this it was uh, Parker Quink blue black so that was kind of washable. All these are very, um, all these inks tend to, um, they don't have a lot of, they're not like pigment, I think, pigment based inks, correct me if I'm wrong, so, uh, doesn't really clog, get clogged at all or leave any kind of residue on the tip, but, um, yeah, I guess I'll show some samples with this pen and this ink um, 
the past um, couple 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 weeks I've been taking some notes with this. Um, yeah, this is just regular paper, and I've been writing on both sides, um, and it hasn't been written through at all. So, actually, this is not regular paper. What is this? This is college ruled five star um, three hole punch paper. So it has the reinforced uh, edge, um, but yeah, that's about it. I yeah, even after eight years, this fountain pen hasn't really shown. Uh, too much, too much wear, or uh, has really needed that much. Um, like I've let it dried out, and you just uh, rinse it out with some water, and it's fine. So, yeah, overall, great first pen. Um, also, if you'd like to um, take a look at this ink, also, um, Scabiosa. Um, it's a real nice purple. So that's all I got. Thanks for watching.